Hey everyone, in this video I want to show you how to use our lineup optimizer spreadsheet tool to uh, pull, to create lineups based on projections. So when you first get the tool, you're going to put your login information, you're going to refresh this week's data, you only have to do that once. And it's going to pull in all the game information with Vegas lines and weather. Down here it'll pull in the, the statistics, all the player information with uh, like the salary, our projections, and uh, different statistics from the, the current year and last year like here's the opponent rank for pos first position and so on and if you scroll down and have all the, di the different players once you're ready to run the lineups you want to move it transfer the players to the multi lineup tab and to do that you're gonna put yes next to all the games you want to run lineups for so I'm just doing it for say the Sunday games I'm gonna click transfer players and what it's gonna do is it's gonna transfer the players where it says yes next to so transfer the players there it's got the different salary information and it's got our projections here and your projections. You'd upload your projections on here. What you do is you put the uh, player's name in and put in the the number and uh, it'll if it it'll where I just showed it showed an error I just deleted that because that just mean that the name's player's name was spelled wrong. That'll pop up if if there's a, a spelling error. Once you add the the stats in here, you put add your projections to the stats tab and it's going to up, update this here. You could, an easier way you could do it, you could copy the names here and paste them or paste them from another spreadsheet that maybe you get uh, projections for. However you want to do it, you get your projections, ours and yours. When you're ready to run lineups, you can pick which projections do you want to run the lineups from, yours or ours. I've got it for ours right now. And then you can run it for FanDuel, DraftKings or Yahoo. I'm just going to run some DraftKings lineups. You could also ha include a player. See where it says include? I put an X next to this player. So that means, and that was uh, David Johnson. So all the lineups have David Johnson. See, we can go back to the multi lineups. And David Johnson has the X next to it. So we included him in all the lineups. It's going to show up what the projections are, the salary, and all, the, all your lineups. Go back to the multi lineups tab here and it'll show you what percentage usage. Like David Johnson was 150 lineups, Corey Davis was in 77, Antonio Brown 67. And then once you're ready to export these, maybe, well, although maybe you don't like it, then you can come back, back in here, adjust your projections, rerun the lineups. Once you're ready, then you can export it to DraftKings by clicking this button, export it to FanDuel by clicking this button. And, uh, and then it's ready to run. Although before you export it, you need to copy in the the lineups from uh, right from FanDuel or DraftKings. You have to get that export, which shows all the uh, player data. And in, in DraftKings, you just go up to lineups at the top and then click upload lineups. And then it allows you to get the lineups for the different slate that you're playing because there's many slates that you could play. So then once you have that, you're going to go in here, click export the lineup, and you're all set. And that's how you use the tool. If you have any questions, uh, let me know. Thanks a lot.